Let's pray before we begin. Lord please let us understand your word and put it in our hearts. May it shape our lives to be more like your Son. In Jesus' name we ask, Amen. Chapter 18 Now after this it came to pass that David smote the Philistines and subdued them, and took Gath and her towns out of the hand of the Philistines. And he smote Moab, and the Moabites became David's servants and brought gifts. And David smote Hadarezer king of Zobah unto Hamath, as he went to establish his dominion by the river Euphrates. And David took from him a thousand chariots, and seven thousand horsemen, and twenty thousand footmen. David also hocked all the chariot horses, but reserved of them an hundred chariots. And when the Syrians of Damascus came to help Hadarezer king of Zobah, David slew of the Syrians two and twenty thousand men. Then David put garrisons in Syria Damascus, and the Syrians became David's servants and brought gifts. Thus the Lord preserved David whithersoever he went. And David took the shields of gold that were on the servants of Hadarezer and brought them to Jerusalem. Likewise from Tibhath and from Kun, cities of Hadarezer brought David very much brass, wherewith Solomon made the brazen sea and the pillars and the vessels of brass. Now when Tohu king of Hamath heard how David had smitten all the host of Hadarezer king of Zobah, he sent Hadoram his son to king David to inquire of his welfare, and to congratulate him because he had fought against Hadarezer and smitten him, for Hadarezer had war with Tohu, and with him all manner of vessels of gold and silver and brass. Them also king David dedicated unto the Lord with the silver and the gold that he brought from all these nations, from Edom, and from Moab, and from the children of Ammon, and from the Philistines, and from Amalek. Moreover, Abishai, the son of Zeruiah, slew of the Edomites in the valley of Salt eighteen thousand. And he put garrisons in Edom, and all the Edomites became David's servants. Thus the Lord preserved David whithersoever he went. So David reigned over all Israel, and executed judgment and justice among all his people. And Joab the son of Zeruiah was over the host, and Jehoshaphat the son of Ahilad recorder, and Zadok the son of Ahitab, and Abimelech the son of Abiathar were the priests, and Shabsha was scribe, and Benaiah the son of Jehoiada was over the Kerathites and the Pelathites, and the sons of David were chief about the king. Matthew Henry Commentary on 1 Chronicles chapter 18, 2 Samuel 19 under the captain of our salvation, will end in everlasting triumph and peace. The happiness of Israel, through David's victories, and just government, faintly shadowed forth the happiness of the redeemed in the realms above. Thank you for listening. If you want to know more about Jesus and what the gospel means to you, then hit the video shown on the left of the screen and please don't forget to subscribe. May the Lord Jesus Christ bless your day.